What is going on there, people? This is Blaze right here, bringing another Smite gameplay match, where I'm going to be testing out another build similar to the Ymir the Sonic build. It seems like this build is kind of iffy. You can actually run with this if you're ahead, and it's clear if you're going to be ahead. And looks like I'm going to go with the new one. Uh, that's good either way. If the new one knows what he's doing, then that's fine. But similar to the Ymir the Sanic build, we are going to be going for the Baloney crit chance build with Balona. Now, this build is extremely risky because from to me, it feels like why would you ever want to like get rid of Balona's tankiness for damage, even though she probably won't even make the most of it. But at the same time, it's like you're still getting this like ridiculous amount of crit damage and it's just wow. So I'm actually going to be going for that. This probably might be another lost game. I get the feeling because our new one seems to be staying at base and yeah, this probably is not going to be going well. And their snake over there is actually a level 10 player, so. Well, I shouldn't say level 10. I should say mastery level 10 is more like it. And yeah, I think our new one DC'd, so... Yeah. Another loss, it looks like. An ally has left the game. How did I know? How did I freaking know? So yeah, this is going to be a 3v5, so this is going to suck entirely. But I am honestly not shocked because I've played so many Siege games before this and yeah they were all bad okay we could have a lifesaver over there but I doubt it because it's still 4v3 but I'll give it a sh I'll give it a chance we still might make something happen I doubt it yeah with the fact that I just can't push overall an ally has returned. Oh look, our new one has returned. I can't believe I missed that whip. <laughs> and considering the fact that new one still hasn't moved, yeah, he DC'd once again. No, oh, Ares does not have to be here. I mean, yeah, oh, that would have been fine. And he goes back over here. Oh, wait, never mind. It was finally moving, so now we can get this 4v4. And he activates the ult. I'm going to go for this disarm, and we get the kill. Good job, Ares. Good ult right there. gonna hold this little rat off so he doesn't uh, stop the recall and I'm gonna put a ward here just in case because they're probably gonna gank the key to victory. I can't even tell how much health I have left because this thing is in the way An ally has been slain. Double kill. You knowing if this opponent is actually smart he's actually gonna start building a bead let me check uh no he's actually not building a bead that's pretty risky that's like a, a, the item you run to fully like counter Ares's ult Your left tower is under attack. Your right tower I guess they want to take the risk and just get the items I mean I do the same thing too but that's just me I, I'm not good Still got Ares to hold my back, and I'm still running with pretty good health. I just want a little bit more farm. These minions just do so much damage early on. It's actually pretty ridiculous. Okay, we got the Ymir kill. I'm actually gonna whip this one into shape. There we go. Excuse me for the bad pun. Damn, I was hoping to still have the whip out. 
With the whip is hidden passive that it, it heals every third auto attack. It's hit successfully. And the rat is missing. I'm actually gonna recall right now. Gonna get a oh oh he got a ult. Oh, that damage. And this is what makes it more amazing. I don't even have any built items yet. Like, I was going to start the Frost Hammer because that's usually what you start with her. But I think I'm going to go straight for this, to be honest. I'm actually going to start going for this right now. Because we got a pretty good start. But like I said, this risk, this, uh, wow, this build <laughs> is what I mean. This build is type risky, so this is actually potentially throwing the game because I'm risking going tank and only doing damage. And well, let's see if I can get him again. Yeah, oh, got him again. If only it does more damage. But hey, I'm gonna st I think the next item I should go for is Frost Hammer, so I will be getting that damage. And I will be getting that good old slow when they run away. These minions are just... Ugh. I could potentially be dead. Well, so it's three over there, and if I head back, we're probably going to lose this tower. But I'm going to have to go back. 750 to get this item. Damn it. I do have an ult in, so if I can make something happen, I could probably get a kill, but I just want them to back away from the tower. Alright, he knows I'm there. Uh, do they have the item now? Yep, he is definitely building the bead now. Now he's trying to... Uh, recover himself from Ares. And we got that good old killing spree. Having that beat is not going to save you from me. It may save you from Ares, but it's not going to save you from me. Okay, I've been targeted. Let's get out of here. Oh, look at this little rat right here. I kill Olten on him. Damn it! I wanted that kill. I can't believe I missed that. Oh, I'm getting chased. Nope. Eh, not too much of a bad trade. I honestly wanted to get the tower, but not going to complain. We're still ahead. Let's start getting some damage. I'm not even sure. I don't know. If this game goes on like this, I don't know if we're going to stay long. She ran away, and I just walked into that like a dumbass. Well, we have nearly avoid the ult, and... Uh, get smacked. Let's get this juggernaut. He ain't gonna do nothing. He's harmless. Are you kidding me? I wasn't even hitting him at all. Well, I'm gonna back away because I need some aggro in the minions. So I won't get hit. No, I'm gonna take these guys out. I should have been paying attention to the bat more. If I didn't take too much aggro, I would have helped. I'm going to finish Let's this item. This. 
And next we're going to go for is the actual hearts. Or I should say lungs of the crit, the baloney build. We're going to go for the Deathbringer and the Rage. I kind of wish he went for the tower instead. Right, he knows what he's doing. He took out the threat first, and let's take out this one first. An enemy siege juggernaut has been destroyed. Oh my god, I thought he was still there. I do have ult. I just don't know if I should go in. I'm not gonna go in. I already finished that item, so I got my attack speed, so let's go for the no reason to hold back. The crit items. I won't be doing it much now. Hopefully the game goes on longer, I should be able to. Your left tower is under and Rally Come on and hit me. He's gonna ult away. Uh, if I had my abilities, I would get him. Your siege juggernaut has arrived. And she got away. I'm not even gonna chase that. Is she actually coming back? She has no tower there. Uh, I guess she's trying to be a decoy. Wow! That ult saved them so much. What even hit me? I guess it was a, a, a part of the ability. Uh, do I have it? No, not yet. 8.30 to get the second part. Like I said, I'm not going to be getting any crit at all with just these items. Oh wait, I can get it now. Okay. By 20%, it's still not really. I still got seven more seconds. I mean, at this rate, we're really not gonna be. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna even make it too far. Damn it! I was just about to teleport to the siege juggernaut. But you know what? I'm gonna go with Nuwa. Nuwa might actually no. Harry's gonna pick up a kill. We still got a first tower up here. Harry's chasing, he actually got it. And there is the signal that they're saying we already won this game. I don't want to jinx it because it's still a bit too early. They could come back. Oh, Harry's with the gank, and they already know. So I'm just going to clear before they get this tower. Does Ares have the item? No, it's just their other guy. Oh, that wasn't even crit. I don't think I can CC her when she's on that. Yeah, I'm not going to bother. Is she coming back? Oh, she's heading up there. Okay. Can I get the ult in? Wow, Freya. Ugh. Freya is just too good. And we probably are won the game right now. Not, to, I actually wanted to show a little bit more of the crit chance, but let's see. Yeah, your mirror's back. Yeah, we're, we're not stopping the game, so we can actually go on. So there's a little hope for the crit chance build. You're probably going to see it done more on minions because I don't think they're really going to fight us anymore. 
I think we could go for the the middle siege. Let's see if it, let's check if it's still up. Or did we already? No, I think it's still up. Right, you can take that. It's not really a fire giant, but yeah, they don't have a command for. And oh wait, it just respawned. Yeah, you better run. Oh my god, I lost track of him. Killing spree. Uh, he's so hard to track, man. He just moves so freaking fast. I didn't get enough crit chance. This is one I tell get well a little bit. It's when I get Deathbringer is when I get the crit chance, but that's that's a given. How much do I need? 830? And they ended up getting it. <clears throat> Ten more seconds. I have two seconds until ult, so we could probably go for this next team fight. If every gear is in another ult, then I can ult right after him, and then we could just go in on them. Or we could just keep doing this. Wow, man. This is lifesavers, aren't they? They just got each other's Enemy back no matter what. I'm actually gonna get these minions. And you can see how much crit damage I'm doing right now. There is. Oh my god. They just got it. Wait, did they just get. No, no, no. That was their regular one. Okay. Is it still here? It is still here. Okay. I'm gonna start it then. Come on, go for the minions. There we go. And it goes straight for me no matter what. I'm actually going to be getting some health back because that would be worth it. Well, the the AFK is going on their end right now. I could actually solo push the leather lane, but I want to see if I can actually get more of a crit chance right now. If not, then, yeah, I'm just going to go for the last uh, situational item in the build, which is uh, Urchin, which is to add more tank. But I could actually just push this right now. I just love the way she, when she attacks, it sounds like she's slapping them. So we're just gonna make mincemeat off of this tower. I kinda don't wanna dive, to be honest. Well, there goes their ults. I just said I did not wanna dive, and I ended up diving anyway. Oh, is that the bait? Can we get a kill on that one? Is there anyone behind me? Look at all that crit damage. There you go. Can I get some health back? Can I get some good crits too? Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> uh, uh, 
it still wasn't enough really but that is the almost baloney crit chance build if I just finished Deathbringer then you would have seen the power of uh, what's it called the baloney crits because it gets ridiculous on how much damage she does and then you know if you're super ahead you get um executioner for more attack speed and yeah you just go ape shit from there on of course if they don't CC you down then you got it but that's what happens do I recommend the build I guess if you're ahead you run it but if not you're just better off building tank but it's still a really fun build if it's not games like this where they just literally just give up but they obviously did not think they could win, so what can you do?